Hey Tabernauts, have you ever been on an airplane before? Tap thumbs up if you have and thumbs down if you haven't. I love airplanes. They always serve pretzels. Mmm, pretzels. Anyway, you probably know that airplanes fly way up high in the sky. Higher than Mount Everest, the tallest mountain on Earth. But there's a limit to how high they can fly, Tabernauts. They can't just go as high as they want. Why not? Well, it has to do with how they fly in the first place. Airplanes fly super fast, so the air pushes back against them really hard. If you've ever stuck your hand out the window of a car, you know what this feels like. If you tilt your hand, you can even feel the air push your hand upwards. The faster the car is going, the more you feel it push. This is just like how planes fly. They go way faster than a car. So the air pushes up against their wings really hard and that pushes them up into the sky. But the higher you go, the less air there is. So it doesn't push up against the wings as much, which means that to stay in the air, the plane would have to go way faster. Space is 10 times higher than an airplane usually flies. And on the edge of space, there's barely any air. So to stay up, an airplane would have to fly 10 times as fast. If it kept going the same speed, the air would just feel like a soft breeze against its wings. Not nearly enough to keep it in the air. Most planes just can't go fast enough to fly that high. But. There are two experimental planes that actually can. They use rockets, like a rocket ship, to blast to super high speeds and flew all the way into space. Also, they didn't take off from the ground. They were carried up to the height a normal plane flies at by a bigger plane and they took off mid-flight. So. There you have it, Tavernauts. That's why most planes can't fly to space, but some can. Maybe by the time you grow up, you'll be able to fly on a space plane. That would be so cool. Bye, Tavernauts. I'll see you next time. That was awesome. If you want to learn even more, you can find hundreds more experiments, lessons, and activities by asking a parent to go to tappityapp.com. We can't wait to see you there.